Hi. Okay, now to read. Well, what shouldn't. What should have been tomorrow's not eight anyway. I, I promise not to mess up it. Anyway, what happens after the video from yesterday? Jacob left Beersheba and sent out to Haran. When he reached a certain place, he stopped. Yeah, that's recording. Okay. He stopped for the night because the sun had set. Oh, yeah, traveling in the dark in the in ancient times is cast to taking one of the stones there he put it under his head and laid down to sleep he had a dream in which he saw a stairway resting on the earth with its top reaching to heaven and the angels of God were ascending and descending on it there above it uh, stood the Lord, and he said, I am the Lord, the God of your father Abraham, and the God of Isaac. I will give you and your descendants the land on which you lay. Your descendants will be like to the dust of the earth, and you will spread out to the west and to the east, to the north and to the south. All peoples on earth will be blessed through you and your offspring. <clears throat> I am with you and will watch over you whenever, no, wherever you go. And I will bring you back to this land. I will not leave you until I have done what I have promised you. When Jacob awoke from his sleep, he thought, Surely the Lord is in this place. I will not... No. Surely the Lord was... No. When Jacob awoke he, from, from his sleep, he thought, Surely the Lord is in this place. And I was not aware of it. Well, technically, he's everywhere, Jacob, so... Anyway... He was afraid and said, How awesome is this place? This is none other than the house of God. This is the gate to heaven. I guess is special though. You know what? Debate if you feel like in the comments. With. Anyway, early in the next morning, Jacob took the stone he had placed under his head and set it up as a pillar and poured oil on top of it. He called the place, he called that place Bethel. Though the city used to be called Luz. Let's see. Bethel means house of God. Oh little town of Bethlehem. Hmm, interesting. Then Jacob made a vow, saying, If God will be with me and will watch over me on this journey I am taking and will give me food to eat and clothes to wear so that I, re so that I return safely to my father's house, then the Lord will be my God, and this stone that I have set up as a pillar will be God's house and of all that you give me I will give you a tenth hey more tithing more tithing the first example of tithing was Abraham giving a tenth of all your own to that guy now Jacob is saying he will give God a tenth of all he owns. More tithing. Before tithing was a thing. If you don't know what tithing is, it's the idea of living on 
living on 90% of your income and giving away a tenth. Or if you really want to be extreme, live on a tenth of your income and give 90% of it away. But that's not needed, though. Anyway.